Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Rahul and in this video we will be looking at a challenge called Operation Orchid. Now the description says that download the image file and find the flag. Now let's just what, uh, what we'll be doing is right clicking on it, clicking on copy it link and let's just w get it. Now what I've done is I've already downloaded it. So when you download this file you'll get a .gz file. So what you'll be doing is gunzip followed by the name of the uh, image which is this and then hitting enter now what you'll be left with is this disk image uh, disk.flag.img now if I were to type in file disk you'll see that this is a boot sector uh, file so what can we do here now there are a couple of options that you have you can use uh, fdisk or mmlm uh, so what I'll be doing is I'll be using mmls disk image disk file uh, flag.img now what this will do is this will list out the partitions now what we'll be doing is we'll be you know uh, going through each one of these partitions and trying to figure out which one contains the flag. Now I don't want to make this lengthy so the process will be the same. So what I'll be doing is I'll be straight away going to the one that has got the flag. So how do we do it? First let me just see if I have made a folder. As you can see I have made a temporary folder called foo in the temp directory. Now what I'll be doing is I'll be mounting a, a partition onto it. So uh, what can you do and how can you do it? So this is the process that I'll be doing for this one. You can straight away also to learn this process also do for this one and this one as well. So let's just start. So you'll be doing sudo mount followed by the name of the file which is uh, disk.flag.img the name of the folder which is this and we'll be using an offset. So offset is equal to so what is going to be the offset? So the offset is this part from where you started. So the start part is going to be 411648 followed by the uh, multiplying the byte size. So it is 512. As you can see, we have already mounted it. So let's just see. Let's sudo su. The reason uh, the reason I'm doing is this because I will need to go to the root directory. To, you know because uh, you, normally users don't have the privileges to go there so now we are in the root directory of the file uh, of the mounted disk so I don't uh, think that decrypt.ttx was there might have uh, been an issue so uh, previously because I mounted it a while ago so let's just cat uh, the ash history you will see that the user is creating a flag he might have entered something and then he would the, towards the end what he did that he shred the file and the re uh, because the reason why he shredded it is, is because he created a f encrypted file which is this file so if i were to type in file followed by the name of the f encrypted file you'll see that it says open ssl encoded da encrypted data with solid password now we know the password and we have the file so why don't we decrypt it so what we'll be doing is open ssl AES 256 tag D for decrypt IN is going to be the file that will be uh, that will be supplying it which is flag.txt.encrypt and the file followed by the output which is going to be decrypt.txt now it's asking for the password so let's just copy the password copied it let's just paste it and let's just see what we get as you can see, we get the pass, uh, password, also the flag for the challenge. So thank you guys. This is it for the video.